Accurate tire modeling is crucial for optimizing the performance of autonomous racing vehicles. Any inaccuracies in these models can lead to undesirable behavior. However, tire parameters vary based on track and tire conditions throughout a race, and this necessitates real-time identification using data collected directly from the track. This paper presents learning based on track system identification for scaled autonomous racing in under a minute. Our proposed method is shown in this schematic. We start by collecting real world data and comparing it to predictions from the nominal vehicle model. Residual errors are captured by training a neural network. This network, combined with the nominal model, forms a correct model that generates virtual steady state data, which we use to identify Pajeka tire parameters. This process is repeated iteratively to ensure better convergence. Now let's see our approach in action with an experiment where we begin with hard tires and later switch to soft tires. We will first identify the Pajeka parameters of the hard tires. Then after switching to soft tires, we will evaluate the vehicle's performance using both hard tire model and the newly identified soft tire model in order to see how well our approach adapts to the change in tire conditions. With no prior knowledge of the tire model, we use a model-free pure pursuit controller to drive the vehicle and collect data. After gathering 30 seconds of driving data, we run our algorithm. This plot displays the identified models at each iteration. Since the initial model is chosen without a reliable prior guess of the true parameters, we run our approach through six iterations to achieve better convergence to true dynamics. As shown, the Pajeka model converges over time. Next, we switch to soft tires and run the vehicle with a model-based controller using hard tire model parameters. After collecting 30 seconds of data, we identify the Pajeka parameters for the soft tires. During this run, we also measure lap times and average lateral errors. This plot shows the identified Pajeka model for the soft tires. Although we expect differences between the hard and soft tire models, we start with the hard tire model as the initial nominal model since it provides a good starting point. Consequently, we run our approach for only two iterations in this step, anticipating quicker convergence to the accurate soft tire parameters. Now, we drive the vehicle with the soft tires using the identified parameters and measure the performance. With the updated model, the vehicle achieves a lap time 0.25 seconds faster and shows a 32% reduction in average lateral error. This demonstrates that our approach effectively adapts to tire changes using only 30 seconds of driving data and approximately 1 seconds of training time for two iterations.